Hi there. My name is Joan Robertson. And I went to church today. And I am running, going, organising a um, Total Salvation Army reunion. And my church leader, Minister, Captain Salvation Army, Captain of Newcastle Worship Salvation Army, um, I after he finished the announcements, I just went up and made my announcements because he won't um, write it in the you know the weekly flyers that churches have. He won't tell the oldies about this uh, special occasion for them. But, uh, it seems to be that there's a bit of a church thing on. Um, Hamilton Salvation Army was formed by Tice Hill. Tice Hill is really Hamilton. It's just got called Hamilton because it's in the suburb of Hamilton. Anyway, I'm just putting on this reunion for the Tice Hill folk. And, you know, I'll get together after 50 years. I think it's not, not a bad idea. It's better to have a get together than have to rock up at um, unpleasant events in people's lives. Whereas we could just have a, a bit of a get together, a nice night, and enjoy each other's company. And this minister is not happy about it. He somehow think, thinks that the other free corps that had to join Hamilton because the Salvation Army was closing down its ranks. It, it first closed in Newcastle, Newcastle Citadel was closed. And then about in 2008, or was it seven, um, Mayfield was sold off and New Lambton was sold off. And we lost all the cause. Anyhow, I don't know how come this is all my fault. I didn't do a thing. I just wanted to hold a reunion. And so I got up today just as he was finishing off the announcements and I made my announcements. And then after the meeting, he was very unchristian-like at the door. Oh, I guess you could expect that. But he was telling me that it's his church, and um, he didn't like being told that it's God's, it's the people's church. I mean, if the people never brought the building at Hamilton, Tysil folks never gave all their money to to build the building. He wouldn't even have a job today. It wouldn't even exist. But I don't know how all this is affecting me, little old me. I just want Thai Hill people, particularly the oldies that are in their 80s, the parents of us baby boomers, they deserve a night of thanks and enjoyment. You know, I really think they do. And that's all I'm trying to do. But this Minister can't see it that way. And he told me it was very rude to get up on this stage and make the announcement, particularly when he told me that no flyers could be put up around the building and he wasn't going to announce it. And he just got a little bit upset because I made the announcement. And nobody knew that there was a bit of a feud going on. But yeah, there is a feud. Why can't Christian people just behave? You know, I just don't understand the ministers. You've got a lot of crap going on in the media at the moment with the ministers. And the Pope wouldn't give the victims of the sexual stuff, pedophilia that was going on, wouldn't give them a minute of his time, an audience. And Cardinal Pell, well, he should be sacked. <laughs> He's uh, probably the biggest sinner of the lot. Yeah. And, and now I sort of got abused. But I guess God's will will be done and the event will go on. And I just have to work out another way to remind the oldies as the event gets closer. So the event is Tysil Reunion. The Salvation Army of Tysil, the reunion is on June the 25th 
at 7 p.m. at Mayfield Bowling Club. And I don't know the hang-ups of the. Ch <laughs> I don't know. I mean, it's supposed to be Christian. Like the man wouldn't even shake my hand, and he was huffing and puffing at me. And yeah, I thought he was going to blow a gasket. I just told him the man up and get over it. Yeah, yeah it was, it's interesting. <laughs> Yeah, well, that's my interesting dilemma. So, Lord knows what's going to happen the next time I try to do something, but I have to do something different next time. I suppose you could just say, well, forget about it, but the fact is, the, the oldies need to be reminded. Uh, you can't just forget about them, you know. They created Hamilton, and they should have a special night. And this minister's not going to wreck their night. It's up to the people anyway if they want to go or if they don't want to go. I should stop rambling on. Bye.